guys. I think it's pretty clear we've reached a point in this series where things are getting a little out of hand. We're acquiring creatures that look like this. This giant smoky dodo wyvern alongside me. This big old... He's called a celestial. Celestial dodo wyvern. Today, we're going to get another celestial. It's going to be a manticore. We might even fight a war chief. But before we do any of that, I have something I need to share with you. Something I didn't know existed. Something I didn't know was possible. However, I've done a little research and I... Well, we're going to experience this for the first time together. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be weird. It's going to be a little wacky. In fact, some of you probably have seen this before, but I can certainly tell you I have not. I need to share this with you guys. So I need to find myself a dinosaur that can swim. Actually, I got my spino. I got my spino. I've actually got away. Okay. All right. Cool. Cool. Okay. Cool. 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 Now, for <laughs> we kind of mentioned not too long ago that there was a little bit of a... An under, I guess it's an underground, like, ocean, I think, beneath this map. There's a big old ocean area. I don't know. It's kind of weird. I've never really been down there. I don't like the ocean. However, today, we're kind of going to go down. Let's just go and do this thing, okay? I have no idea how this is going to work out or if it's even going to work out. But basically, I'm going to grab this spino. I'm going to run it down the river over here a little bit. And I'm pretty sure you just saw that health bar, right? There is a health bar way down beneath this map. And this is the access point to it. I have no idea if I can even get down there, though. I might just need to swim. I do have tech helmet. All right. I think we can do that. I think we can do this. I think we can just head down on our own. I still got my little Rex on my shoulder. I think we just come through here. And then... Oh... Oh, uh, yeah, there he is. <laughs> there's, a, there's a Titan down here beneath the map, and he's about to shock me. All right, all right, I'm going all the way down. Hey, buddy, <laughs> don't mind me. How am I going to get out of here? Lucky for me, I guess we've got, uh, I guess we've got teleporters. But yeah, how's this, hey? Eh? What is this? I've never seen this before. I never knew that this laid down here beneath the map. I have played on this map multiple, multiple times. Look at the little, like, this is a party, the dodo party going on down here. And then you got, oh, there he is. Then you got this guy all the way up there. Now, I got no idea how I'm going to get him down from there. I kind of want to kill him, though. I don't think I can reach him with that. I, do I have any abilities on, like, do I? I got some arrows. All right, hold on. I might be able to like aggro him and get him down. Maybe I should have brought a flyer with me. Is that going to reach? Can you even damage it? Yeah, no, it definitely hit. It definitely hit. Yeah, there we go. But like, now what? He's all the way up there. I need him to come down here. Buddy, what are you even doing? Maybe I should have just stayed up there. I got no, I got no ways of getting him down from there. Dang it, I want to fight him. That's the whole point. Of, that's the whole reason I came down here. I guess I could head home and come back. I think we're going to have to. All right, I'm going to teleport out of here. And we're going to come back with Zephyrus, our giant dodo wyvern. And I'm going to kick this desert titan's butt. Honestly, I, I don't even, I don't even, I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't know what to say. This is the weirdest thing ever. I didn't expect that to be this little, like, underground civilization. Pretty much beneath my base. It is beneath my base. But it's no longer going to be run. It's no longer going to be taken over by the Desert Titan. I just want to have a little look around here, though. Because this is... This is huge. You could build a massive base down here. I don't even know... Are there, like, strong guys around here? Oh, there's a few entrances. I can see... Oh, this must be what all the caves lead to. Well, Desert Titan, my friend, how much health have you got? 800,000. Can I just one-shot you? No, but we can 10-shot you. Well, may as well go and get it done. Can I just breathe lightning on you? Can we do that? Is that a quicker way to kill you? I don't know. I just want to see if I unlock any cool stuff out of this. Yo! <laughs> how about a little bit of everything? Uh, oh, wait a second. Well, well, for one, we got like a ton of loot. We got the Desert Titan trophy. Um, we got tech legging. Wait, hold on. Have we finally unlocked like the whole tech set? Is that what we've been needing to kill this entire time? Tech leggings, gauntlets, boots, still no jetpack. 
Let's do an no jet pack. Dang it. I, I still want the hoverness, but we, it's not, we just can't get it apparently. Um, how about... Do we happen to unlock... I didn't... We unlocked so much stuff just then. I missed all of it though. Ah, we still didn't have a mutator though. Dang it. Oh, well, anyways, that's all I wanted to start today with. <laughs> Let's go now. Let's go and get ourselves another Celestial because that is ultimately what I want to work towards. I'm still just speechless on the matter. Rather, not speechless because I can't stop talking, but I just did not expect that to be beneath my face. That's, that's so weird. It's kind of like... I'm just trying to think. It, it reminds me of like Gurren Lug, and if you've ever watched the anime where there's like a little underground. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. There's little. There's a little village underground, basically. Anyways, let's do this thing. What do we need to get ourselves? I can't even remember what this thing's called. But this guy, not you. This one, Hephaestus. I need myself Hephaestus. Unfortunately, we need a Manticore saddle. I don't want to use this one though, because look how good this thing is. 1800 armor. That's ridiculous. Um, what else do we need? The core and we need Manticore Essence. Well, I've got the Manticore Essence. Have some extra heads as well while I'm at it. I don't want to give you the helmet, so I'm, uh, the, the saddle. So I'm going to try and craft that up myself. And to get the core, we obviously need... What do I need, actually? Let me have a look. Actually, what do I need for a Manticore Saddle? It was just a regular Manticore Saddle, right? Either way, I need all the artifacts, basically. Chaos, Growth, and Void. Easy easiness easiness right there chaos growth and last but not least the void and once all three of those are crafted up we should be ready to get ourselves the hephaestus core check and just to be certain it just wants a regular man's core saddle sweet this one here nice and cheap that's not cheap at all 1000 black pearls i need my black pearls no that's really expensive as a matter of fact uh, we don't have a choice there, do we? Unless... Unless... Okay, look, I really don't want to waste these black pearls because I want to save them for summoning more of these giant bosses in. Um, we actually do have a bunch of wardens out there. We got three El, El Diablos out there. I think we need to go and fight them. And I say that because there is a chance El Diablo drops real saddles. The rest of them all drop blueprints, I'm pretty sure. El Diablo drops the real deal. So if I can head out there, we might be able to just get a Manticore Saddle dropped from him and go from there. I just need to work out who my strongest hitting Rex is. Not you. Might be you. No. I think it's you. No. You're the strongest. This guy right here. Yeah. Wait, is it? Or well, is it shoulder? You're only 15,000 damage. You also don't have a great saddle. All right, you know what? You go on the shoulder. That's that's your that's your job after all. Or do I take my friend here? Hmm. Yeah. That way, at least I can, like, fly there. Okay, let's go. We got some El Diablos to take down. All right, there he is. The first of the three. 162 million health. Nothing too crazy. There's also a Prime Alpha T-Rex out here, too. Um, all right, well, gonna get my guy onto this, and hopefully we can just get a Manticore Saddle drop straight off the bat and be done. Who knows? But this guy here, he actually hits with quite some, with quite some power, I tell you what. No, I'm gonna stun you. What do you think you're doing? Oh, wait, I gotta, I gotta wait for my T-Rex to stun you. I forgot. I'm not riding around on a T-Rex currently. Maybe I should be. <gasps> That's a character of Dontosaurus over there. Yo, I haven't seen many of them yet. That's kind of cool. All right, what's my T-Rex doing? He's just chilling on my shoulder for a free ride right now. All right, at least we got some minions on the way. At least gash him a little bit. Whoa. Where'd he go? Oh, you're joking. He must have fallen through the ground. That sucks. Well, I guess, I guess well, that, that's really sucky as a matter of fact. Um... Cool. I guess I guess that's one down. And unfortunately, we've got no loot to show for it. Poo. Well, that's not quite what I was looking for. We got old Mega Dodo Rex out here. We also got Supreme Dodo Reaper. Wait, was there even one over here? Yeah, there he is. Oh, there's two Mega Dodo Rexes out here. We've also got a bunch of minions out here, apparently. Who do you guys even belong to? Hey, do you guys want to come and 
do some battling for me or what go go fight i, I okay you guys must have been here waiting to me for me a while that's all i'll say um all right let's go i'm not really looking to fight this dodo rex so i don't know why i'm even doing this right now but we gotta take down el diablo you know what i might just sit back and let my little minions do their thing i don't need to fight these guys i'm just gonna chill up here i know that they can handle their own i'll just sit out of harm's range or at least mostly out of harm's range and uh reap the benefits reap the spoils of battle and i think that might be no okay supreme dodo reaper has gone down um it's just this guy left and of course the mega dodo rex i have no business fighting that though i don't need to i don't think it's this guy actually wait should i just be fighting man's cause there's probably a chance Manticore just hooks me up with what we need anyways. All right, regardless, El Diablo is just about done. There we go. And we've got a... What did I get? I saw... Ah, it. oh, it's just another... Never mind. We didn't get... We didn't get anything, really. Kind of disappointed. All right, you know what? Stop this idea. Let me just go and... Let me just go and waste a thousand black pearls. We can go and get more. Uh, all right coolies my goodness all right i didn't expect that but i think we just had a void worm fly into our base and angered everybody wowzers okay cool fair enough anyways let's get this guy happening hey let's get this manticore i am done with waiting um a face just oh the saddle that's right we need the manticore saddle just a regular one let's get it crafted up waste all our resources on it sure and all that's left for us to do is pull the elements across which we have plentiful amounts of craft this thing up throw it into me hot bar and let's do it three two one welcome hephaestus if i can't even pronounce it hephaestus the celestial manticore damn this thing looks tough oh this thing is like a super powered version of the one we fought yesterday dude you look so much better than the war chief. Also, speed wise, not terrible. Not terrible at all. Now I've got to get you nice and leveled up. So, level 750, which is pretty crazy. We've got a pretty ridiculous Manticore saddle to throw on its shoulders, too. We've got. What in the world? Well, we've got our first victim over here. Double Manticore. Fighting. I can't even hit it. Got him. Wait, what? No, 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 no. 32,000 damage? Oh, can we just stop dropping minions everywhere? What are we just summoning minions everywhere? We're just, just throwing minions around from the sky. It's raining minions at this point. Who even knows? At least my Manticore made it down in one piece. <laughs> All right, let's just max this guy out straight away and see what he can do. So we're looking at 7.8 million base health as per our uh dodo wyvern yesterday we're gonna go to 25 million because it just sounds like a nice amount speed actually this guy's got a good spread of levels terrible speed which is good but you know obviously we like speed but it doesn't matter different kind of speed um as per the dodo wyvern it's gonna be one percent movement speed per level which is a bit of a shame i think stamina is gonna be a big part because this guy here is draining stamina i'm not even doing anything so i'll go and put like i'll give it twenty thousand stamina just just in case this guy does end up being like a viable fighter Ninety-two thousand. okay there we go all right you know what i might just set my guy on my shoulder to passive he doesn't need to keep summoning minions all the time i do want to test this guy's attacks though and we've got a new diablo in the world that maybe i should go and test it out on that's pretty cool all right whoa Okay, that T-Rex, not T-Rex, that um Triceratops just hooked us up with about 200 black pearls. Wait, do Alphas give black pearls? Because that would save me a lot of time. Well, not save me time, but it gives me options on things I can fight for black pearls. That's good. That's good. Very good. Anyways, we got 259 levels that we got to throw somewhere. And uh, you better believe most of those are going towards melee damage. 10,000%. That's a nice old number. I don't know if it's enough. Maybe I should give my guy here some more health just to kind of balance things out a little bit. Should I give him some more speed? Probably. 
How much though? We'll go to 150 and then the rest into damage and we'll see what sort of damage he can actually do. 1.5 million, not bad. Oh, that's really good. All right, now I'm going to go find someone to test this on. I still want to take down... Well, Diablos are the best. Oh, they're both over there too. We got Frogman. We got... Yeah, I'm not going to go underwater. Turtles, Spike. There's a few around. Yeah, all right. Prime Alphas hook you up with Black Pearls. Well, I guess that's going to be the way I get all my Black Pearls for our next War Chief Summon. We just need a few thousand of them. That's the only thing. Lucky for us, though, we're heading to basically where these things live by the dozens. The snowy type of area. Also, this giant rock in the middle of the island. Center. It's the center. It, 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 it literally, it's, it's why it's called the way it is. Anyways. Yes, this guy is indeed a killing machine. However, so are these guys. My goodness, some of them were hitting me for like 100,000 damage just then. That is quite tough. Not tough enough to stop my manticore, but, but tough. Aha. Uh -huh. No, you're not what I thought I was about to run into. But I will happily take you on, old Kijun, the Supreme Tiger. Let me test out some of my other attacks, though. Okay. Yes. <laughs> that deals 3 million damage if it's a direct hit. Yo. Oh, okay. That is strong. If it actually lands. Which I... Oh, we got a chibi. Yo, all right. Yo, we got a chibi parasol. I mean, uh, all right, let's bring it with us. All right, little chibi on the shoulder. Why not? Did it drop anything else though, or is that it? I think that's legit. All it dropped. Okay. Aha, you're the one I was looking for, mate. All right, let's get our Rex. There's little minions in here to help us out too. I'm gonna make short work of this guy. All right, do my extra attacks actually do damage to this thing or not? I don't actually know. Because nothing's really... I think he's stunning my attacks. Like, whenever I go to use one, it's like he prevents me from using it. Or at least that's how it felt there. All right, I need my T-Rex to bring some minions into this. Or at least freeze this guy in place. Because I'm having a little bit of trouble against him right this second. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. For whatever reason, he's actually kind of stopped attacking as well. So, hey, that's that's a win, I guess. He's just sitting there taking it. This is awesome. This is great. Fantastic. Well, as long as I keep gashing him, he's going to keep on bleeding out. And eventually, we are going to get a free El Diablo kill. Watch, give me the Manticore saddle. I want it as well. I guarantee you it's about to. Mm, no, it's dead a and saddle. Never mind. And I'm pretty sure it was a blueprint too, so didn't even matter. Alrighty, it seems that ancients are actually really good for black pearls too, so that's nice. We've also got a few little tech friends here as well who need conquering very, very quickly. So yeah, you can better believe I'm going to be doing that right this second. I wonder if they hook us up too. Not nah, just element and lots of it, so that's nice. But yeah, I think the uh, volcano is going to be the hot spot for getting our black pearls for these extra war chiefs. Since, yeah, ancients seem to do a pretty good job of hooking us up with the stuff. So, yeah, awesome. That's great. Means it's going to save me a little bit of work for tomorrow where we eventually get another one of these guys. I'm excited. Speaking of ancients, an ancient fire wyvern? Can I even hit this thing? Yeah, there we go. Never seen one of these out in the wild before. This is kind of cool looking. All right, let's quickly just get rid of him. Can't even get close to him. There we go. What'd you give? You give me anything? Absolutely anything of interest? Eh, at least we got some black bells. Or maybe that was from the Bronto I killed before. I'm not too sure. Either ways, we're getting close to another one. And that is uh, ultimately... Oh, now I got to stop and kill these guys too, don't I? You better believe it. Give me them black pearls. There's another one. 20. And from this other one, another 120. Nice. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm pretty glad we ended up going for the Manticore because this guy is an absolute pleasure to fly around on. A lot nicer than the Dodo Wyvern, I'll tell you that. At least I can see what I'm doing in first person view. Um, it's pretty hard. 
I think might even hit harder than the Dodo Wyvern, to be honest. It's actually kind of hard to compare the two, but he's an absolute machine. Who comes next? Who do we fight tomorrow? Who do we summon tomorrow? I guess you're going to have to tune in to find out. I'm, yeah, haven't decided just yet, but uh, hey, guys, I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye for now.